Welcome. Today we're going to be doing a test run of the 40 horse Tahatsu jet drive. And we're on a 1652 G3. It's not fully loaded, but it's loaded with most of what I bring to crappie fish. So life jackets, cooler, there's no water in there. My graph, trolling motor, tackle box, couple rods, and a full almost like just right there full tank of gas so i've got my bass pro shirt on my fish hey dudes and we got a river and we got a jet and there's no videos on youtube of any kind of test run with one of these not that i've found so figured i'd do one myself so let's listen to this thing start up huh Nice. I get my handy dandy hand strap on. Strap on. Don't get it confused with the the other strap on. All right, we've got probably a quarter mile until the main stretch of the river. So what I'm probably gonna do. Is I'm probably gonna turn around and go upstream just a touch and then turn around again to run this stretch of the river because there was some kayaks <clears throat> there was some kayaks in the other stretch so I'm not trying to kill anybody today That's cool. oh, completely trimmed up but we were right there at 30 mile an hour so hopefully if there's nobody on this main stretch it's really shallow right here on this point so I gotta go gotta go far out and around snap time curve shoot I don't know what to think because I'm if I start hauling ass and then there's a kayak in the middle of the river, I'm I'm screwed. But we was right there at 30. I wasn't trimmed up all the way. I think on the right situation, I think I'd get 35 out of her. But uh, we're gonna try this again.
So we're back at the house and just wanted to finish up the video. I got, uh, there's a bunch of people at the boat ramp and I didn't want to be talking there, having a good time and cooking food. So thought I'd wait till I get home, but we got the, we got the 40 horse Tahatsu jet on the 1652 G3. Probably somewhere, everything in it right now. Mm, we'll call it close to 900 pounds I'd say motors 325 boats 450 you know you got two batteries gas tank somewhere I'm gonna call it nine nine to a thousand pounds somewhere in there but we had a top speed of I believe it was 29.6 before I had to let off and I couldn't trim up all the way the the river got you know I ran out of room that was downstream so I'm sure I could have hit 30 upstream it was pretty windy I got 29 I think I got 29 on the dot so that gives you a rough estimate on what you're looking at here but I just wanted to make this video because nobody that I could find on YouTube has made a video with this specific motor and so I took one for the team and got it done. Well, you guys have a good day. I'll talk to you later. Peace.